Welcome back to Iraqi Dinar, where I provide the latest insights and news concerning the Iraqi Dinar and the Vietnamese Dong. In today's video, we're exploring some significant developments in the Forex market and anticipating the market's opening at 5 p.m. Eastern Time. Several critical updates are emerging that currency holders should be aware of, as they could impact their financial strategies. Firstly, according to Intel guru Bruce via Wiesa, there's an important note regarding redemption centers for currency exchanges. These centers are offering rates significantly higher than those available at traditional banks. This initiative aims to provide a better return for individuals looking to exchange their Iraqi dinar and Vietnamese dong. This attractive arrangement could play a pivotal role for currency holders as they seek to navigate the complex forex landscape. Many believe we are approaching a crucial transition point in the currency exchange process, with discussions underway about finalizing essential budget tables and concluding the work of auctions. The optimism surrounding potential changes in the exchange rate has everyone watching closely as it's hoped we may see movement before the year concludes. Furthermore, negotiations between Iraq and the US are heating up, particularly in terms of indirect discussions with Washington. The Iraqi government is making considerable efforts to create a favorable environment for these talks, showcasing a willingness among all parties to engage in productive dialogue. This could mark a transformative moment for Iraq's economic prospects. By positioning itself favorably in international negotiations, Iraq could see substantial economic advancement, which in turn would impact the value of its currency. Another notable trend is the recent purchasing behavior of the Iraqi dinar within U.S. banks. There have been discernible discrepancies in exchange rates offered by various banks, with some providing rates as low as 1% and others reaching up to 2%. Personally, I secured my dinars from an American cash bank that indicated supply sources from Bank of America in Street. Louis. These buying trends signal an increasing interest in the Iraqi dinar among investors and currency traders. Moreover, a significant conversation is unfolding surrounding the necessity for a comprehensive overhaul of banking policies in Iraq. Al Hindi, a member of the Parliamentary Investment Committee, emphasized the critical need to rebuild citizens' confidence in the banking sector. One of his suggestions was to offer interest rates as high as 40% annually, which could serve as an incentive for citizens to deposit their funds in banks. This step would not only foster trust in the banking institutions but could also lead to increased liquidity within the financial system. Additionally, the rise of electronic payment systems is transforming Iraq's banking environment. It has been reported that between 3 to 4 trillion dinars were collected through these systems within just two months. This substantial amount highlights the popularity and effectiveness of digital banking solutions in Iraq. The shift towards a digital economy is not merely a matter of convenience it promises enhanced transparency, improved services for citizens, and a streamlined approach to financial operations. The Central Bank of Iraq, CBI, reported that during a recent currency auction, their sales of US dollars exceeded $265 million. The transactions were completed at a base exchange rate of 1,310 IQD per dollar for documentary credits and international settlements. The total dollar sales represented a clear goal of bolstering balances abroad through various mechanisms, highlighting the ongoing demand for dollars in international trade. These developments indicate a dynamic shift in Iraq's financial land escape. As we continue to monitor these changes, the future appears promising for the Iraqi economy and its currency. I am eager to keep you updated on these exciting developments in the coming days so stay tuned for more insights and news. Thank you for joining me today on Iraqi Dinar.